Hey DIYers, Dylan here with Alarm Grid. Uh, today we're going to review how to pair a Schlage Wi-Fi lock with an Alarm.com account. So the first thing you'll need to do is set up the lock with the Schlage Home app. We already has, uh, have ours set up here. And then you're going to use the login credentials from this application to pair it with the Alarm.com account. So we're going to show you how to pair this through either the website or the Alarm.com application. Okay, so here we are in the Alarm.com application. Uh, to add our Schlage lock, we're going to first go to More, which is in the bottom right-hand corner. We're going to press on Add Device. Now, we see the lock option there, which is what we're going to press in just a moment. Uh, if you do not see the lock option when you go to this page, you're going to want to contact your alarm monitoring company and have them enable the lock feature for your account. We have that enabled already, so we're going to press on Lock. We're going to scroll down and we are using the Schlage and Code Lock, so we'll press that. I'm going to press Next. Okay, now we're going to enter in the uh, login information for the Schlage account that we had set up. Okay, so after we have entered in the login information for the Schlage account, it's going to do a Discover device, so we'll just wait. Okay, perfect. Device has been discovered because we already had it linked to the Schlage account. I'm going to press Continue. Okay, excellent. So congratulations. The device has been successfully added to your account. So we'll press Done. And then now what we'll do is we're going to make sure it's communicating properly. So we can go to Manage Devices. Okay, we have the lock there. And as you can see, there's not really much for device settings here. Uh, it's just going to ask you to unlink your account. And then we have here <clears throat> on the uh, main page again, uh, we have the lock showing. So we can try locking it. Okay, perfect. It is showing locked. And we can confirm at the lock itself that it had locked. And then we'll also do the unlock feature. Okay, we got the confirmation from the lock itself, and then alarm.com is also showing uh, that it is unlocked. So we have it successfully paired to the alarm.com application, and we have full uh, control over the lock itself. All right, so we are on the alarm.com website now. Uh, so to get this added through the website, we're going to go to settings. We're going to go to manage devices. And then we're going to press Add Device at the top right. Okay, so we see the lock option there. And again, uh, if you do not see this option, make sure to contact your monitoring company and have them enable the lock feature for you. Uh, so since we have this enabled, we'll uh, press on Lock. We're going to press on Schlage and Code, as that's the lock we're using today. Okay, we'll press Next. And you're going to enter in the login information for the Schlage account. Okay, so we've entered in the login information. It's found our device, so we can do continue. Okay, it's showing us that it's paired successfully. We'll do done. And now we see on the main page that we do have the lock showing as alarm grid. So you can access that from there. And let's go ahead and test it. So we're going to press lock. It's going to send the command to the lock. Okay, we got the confirmation from the lock and alarm.com is showing the locked feature. So we're now going to make sure that we can unlock as well. Send the unlock command.
call information at the lock, and also in alarm.com. Okay, so that's how you pair your Schlage lock to alarm.com. Uh, we went over both the website and the application setup, and then we tested to make sure that it is communicating properly as well. If you did enjoy the video, please like and subscribe, and hit the bell icon to be notified about any future videos we release. If you have any questions, feel free to contact us. Uh, we have a support phone line. Phone number is 888-818-7728. Uh, we have an email. The email address is support at alarmgrid.com. And we also have a live chat on our website, which is www.alarmgrid.com. Again, my name is Dylan from Alarmgrid, and thank you for watching.